What's going on, YouTube? This is Ricky J. Holy cow, man. Welcome to episode two. Oh, man. I got to tell you, in this one, we're going to be using Brett the Hitman Hart. This series is all about the teams, man. In WWE 2K23, they've now programmed the AI is actually going to work together in teams. So today we've got the Heart Foundation, the Bloodlines, the Anoai. I'm probably saying it wrong. Anoai. It's uh, with Yokozuna, Rikishi. We added the Rock, Umaga. We got the Heenan family. We have Matty Ice's team, a fellow subscriber of mine. Awesome guy. We have the Brawling Brutes, the New Day, Legado del Fantasma, and I think that's it. I think I've hit them all, man. But we are coming in at one, and there's a new rule. Every time we start a rumble, we are always going to feature a team. Okay, so right now, right here, let me know if you agree with that. But right now, right here, we got myself coming in, Brett the Hitman Hart. And coming in next will be a member of the Hart Foundation. Maybe Owen Hart. It may be the British Bulldog. Amen. It may be Jim the Anvil Neidhart. So we're going to start it off like that. I only feel like it's the right thing to do to honor the team-based rumble and to see just how these teams work together. We saw Scott Hall, Kevin Nash working together nicely in the last episode. And um, maybe if they work great, you could just continue to knock guys out as they come in and yeah it's Jim the Apple <laughs> Jim the Apple coming in some people say this is the best tag team of all time this tag team is up there is one of my favorites it's the Hart Foundation and the Rockers Marty Jannetty Shawn Michaels are my two favorite tag teams of all time let me know your favorite tag team of all time in the comments brother I'll do my best to reply back to whatever you select as your favorite but let's see how we do man I want to say again on a side note this game is so new so it's slim pickings on creation zone that's why you are going to see some teams that are under the uh, limit of five you know you got some teams the new day brawling brutes they are definitely under five and they are still in this rumble I had to do that even the Heart Foundation, we're only featuring four members. I couldn't put Brian Pillman in there. But here we go without further ado. All right, yeah, brother. Okay, we're not going to, uh, we're not gonna engage. Not gonna engage at all as we relax and wait. And then once somebody does come in, I'm telling you, man, we are going to pounce on them. We are definitely gonna pounce on them. Here we go, let's see what happens. We're letting the countdown go down. Now the thing is, if you accidentally hit your own teammate, they will turn against you. So we got to be careful. Oh, it's perfect. It's perfect. Who's perfect gonna go after? Let's, we're gonna come on. There we go, right away. <laughs> we gotta work quick. <laughs> go ahead, Evil. Take over, brother. Take over. Oh, no way. There's no way you're going to be working with my teammate. Now it's your turn. Nice. We've got to work quick. We've got to work quick. Here, I'm going to try to... Three, two... Okay, let's see if we can get him out of there. Oh, Rikishi. I don't think we can, but let's see. Work together. Come on. No. <laughs> Wishful thinking. Oh, there we go. Got to continue working on perfect in hopes of um, maybe getting him eliminated and then helping out the anvil here. Here we go, perfect. Oh, he's done. Yes, now we're down to the handicap match again. Oh no, come on anvil. Help me out. Wow, Rikishi's taking on the Heart Foundation. He's doing a good job. Oh, here comes Big Daddy Ice. Uh-oh, this guy's a big boy. Wow, man, the number, it just goes down too quick. As we are now going to be up against it, the Heart Foundation being outsized here. But that was a cool sequence there for a quick moment. Look at this. The Anvil and I are exhausted. Oh. Let's see if we can go after the big man here. Wow. Oh, this guy's unstoppable. The Heart Foundation. Here comes Cruz del Toro. 
And it's so cool, though, how the Anvil's still not coming after us here. Let's see if the Anvil can stay in there, and so and so can I, hopefully. So you know what? Oh, man. Don't do it, brother. Don't do it. Oh, I'm frozen. Frozen, don't turn on me. I want to help out Jim the Anvil. Come on. Okay, I'm back. Yes. And I'm going to be secretly... Come on, Rikishi. Get out of here, brother. Get out of here. Get out of here. Here comes Sheamus. Man, I'm trying to go to Anvil's side to help him out, but there's just too much traffic in the ring. Let me know if you want me to take off the commentary. Yeah, let me know if you want me to take off the commentary. I feel like it kind of adds to the fun. Oh, there it is. Here we go. Now we can work together. How about this? Come on, Sheamus. Rich Holland. Part of the Brutes. <laughs> Let's see if he comes after us. But the Anvil, he is coming after us. The Anvil seems okay. Oh, no. Oh, come on. I thought I had it. I thought I had it, but we got to help out our old buddy. There we go. Oh, Rikishi. Don't do it, brother. I found, like, the game is harder to... Um, get reversals. I don't know if it's just me. I'm just getting old. Here comes Jay Uzo. Jay Uzo. And he's giving me the butt action. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> he's giving me the butt action. I gotta lower the volume just a touch. Holy smokes. Bret Hart's exhausted. But it, what's cool is we haven't seen Anvil turn on us at all. So this is nice to see. Because we're still trying to Help him out here. Rikishi is a problem. This big man is a problem. I'm going to try to stick. Here comes Butch. Oh, he's trying to. No. Oh, finally a reversal. Or, yeah, a counter. I'm trying to stick with the anvil to help him out. <laughs> I'm not looking to win this rumble. This is going to be tough, man. Yeah. No. Oh, wait. Wow. She oh, nice job by Anvil. Saving us as Bret Hart. <laughs> this man is exhausted again. Here we go. Oh, are we going to get him? Oh, Rakishi. Too big, too strong. And look at this. Big Daddy Ice is still in there. See if Big Daddy Ice is going to go for a ride. No. Oh. See if we can get Jey Uzo. Come on. No. Oh. What is that? There's too much going on, man. Oh, I tried to get rid of him. No. Oh. Everybody's just coming at us. Oh, Sheamus is done. He is done. I'm telling you, the Anvil's doing a tremendous job here. He's doing a tremendous job. As we're slowly getting to our feet. Rikishi's still in there. Holy cow, this guy. Every time I try to go for something. Oh, no, no. No! Where was the anvil when we needed him? Oh, too little, too late, man. That is disappointing. That is absolutely disappointing, man. The Heart Foundation. One brother's done, and now another one as well. As we slowly make our exit out of here. Oh, that is just... Oh, that is too bad, man. That is too bad, but... There's still a lot of rumble left here. You got Jay Uzo, Big Daddy Ice, Butch, Ridge Holland. Oh, that is too bad. Big John Stud representing the Heenan family. 
Did I mention that in the beginning? Holy cow, things are happening a mile a minute. But here comes Big John Stud. But Big Daddy Ice. I always want to, you know, feature some of your creations as well. So let me know, man. I would love to do one group per video if possible. But, man, I thought we were doing some good things. You know, the ring was just, it felt like it was smaller. <laughs> There's just not enough room to do anything there. And the Heart Foundation got taken out. Here comes Solo Sokoa. And he's part of the Bloodlines here. We put him part of the Bloodlines. And then, you know the other team that's uh, with Umaga, Rikishi. How do you say that name? Oh, there goes. Oh, nice job with Big John Stud. The Anoai? Tell me, let me know in the comments, but probably butchering it. You know what's crazy? I went on Google to, to see and I totally forgot. Anoai, but anyway. Aren't they all tied together? The Bloodlines and uh, the NOI family? <laughs> Here comes Big E's. Oh my gosh. Here we go. What? What? This is part of the team YouTube here. Big E-S. Wow. I thought it was Big E for a second. I hesitated. But this man is a massive beast. And let's see how he does here. You still got um, Big Daddy Ice who is still in there. Solo Sokoa. Look at that. He's not going after Jey Uzo. Now he's helping him out. And here comes the snake. This is another guy that's part of this team YouTube. Wow. So what we're seeing here, man. I know a lot of things have been going on, but we are seeing that the teams are working together. Oh, nice hip toss elimination there by Big John Stud. Oh, as I say, the teams are working together. You got Snake and the, the Big Daddy there, Big Daddy Ice that are not working together. So I guess in the early stages of the Rumble, they do, I guess. I don't know, here comes Kofi Kingston, part of the New Day. And let's see how Kingston does coming in midway through this Royal Rumble. Big John Stud. Oh, man. Wow. Nice DDT there. And these big bodies that are in here. <laughs> Matty Ice's creations. He's smart, man. How he created these guys, he's smart because he's created a lot of big dudes. And these big dudes are tough to get eliminated. And how about this? Oh, Jey Uso still in there. Here comes Rick Rude representing the Heenan family. So let's see if Rick Rude could work with Big John Stud. Is Are we, are we going to see an elimination here? Yes, we are. What a job by this big guy, Big ES. <laughs> Bigs. Oh, there goes Rick Rude. He barely lost it. There goes Big John Stud. Oh, my gosh. Don't people ever, ever learn inside these things you can never sprint you can never run in a rumble because it's going to get you eliminated and now we are down to kofi kingston big daddy ice jay uzo snake and big es holy cow these big boys are running things oh nice power slam by the big man Look at that t-shirt. <laughs> Look at that t-shirt. Don't tell me kicks it's going to be done. Oh, they're going to work together. But Jay Uso, man, that guy is still in there. He's been in there for quite some time. We were battling with him. And he's still in there, but he's dealing with three of Matty Ice's teams or, or, or of his members. And it's tough stuff now. It's tough stuff. Here we go. Jimmy Uso. Let's see if Jimmy could let Jay recover here and they could make a long run. Look at that. The brothers. Oh no, don't tell me Snake's gonna do it. Sweet Chin Music. Oh. Sweet Chin Music and Jay is done. Now you got Jimmy. It's gonna be interesting to see when Roman Reigns comes in. When is Roman Reigns gonna come in? That's the question to save this guy to save a member of the Bloodlines. And it's Owen Hart. Here we go, Owen Hart. 
Come on, part of the Hart Foundation. And look at Owen. That's not the best Owen Hart I've ever seen in the creation zone, but it's slim pickings. Owen Hart looking like, uh, who's the guy, uh, Owen Wilson. <laughs> this is way too funny, man. But I'm hoping, you know, as the weeks go, as the days, weeks, months go by, you know, the creation zone becomes uh, more of a, a deeper library. Here comes Big E. Because right now you'll see, like I looked up Street Fighter and um, I tried to download some Street Fighter members, but Ryu, he was just like an out of shape uh, big man with a gi on. It wasn't the right character to feature on this channel. So we just gotta wait. <laughs> Team Street Fighter won't be making their appearance in this season anytime soon, man. And anytime soon, but it's wild to see the Matty Ice team just do so well here. You got the Snake, you got Big ES. Here comes Jackie Matsumoto, and that is another member of this team. That's the final member of this YouTube team. Now, the only thing is we um, randomize these guys that are coming in. They are coming in midway. So if they're gonna do it, they're gonna have to stay in there and work together, but we shall soon see as Kingston doing a nice job using that speed. Holy smokes, a lot of action. And now are we gonna see Big Daddy Ice? He's hanging on, Gravity may beat him. Oh, Gravity does not beat him. He does a nice job recovering. And now you got Snake in the corner. Snake's had a tough time just kind of getting going here in this rumble. He's a high flyer, he's not a big boy. So he's had some difficulty. And now, how about this? Jimmy Uso could be done. Oh, he's trying to, oh, eliminated. Oh man. Whoa, how about this? The teammates working against each other. Now I'm hoping in the next patch that they really iron that out. I feel like the teams are working better together. But right there, no way, there's an elimination. But in this showcase so far, they've been working pretty good. Let's see if uh, Big E and Kofi Kingston could do something together here. But right now, Big E's in some big trouble as Big Daddy Ice, oh, nice job. Kofi tried to save him. So there was a little teammate action there. He tried to save him, but Seems like the theme of this rumble is too little too late. Isn't that true, man? Too little too late seems to be. And now Xavier Woods coming in now at 21. Let's see if Kofi could get some help here. It's Xavier Woods. This guy's a tremendous athlete. Oh man, let's see if he can you gotta get some of these, uh, the, he's probably thinking, you gotta get this uh, Team YouTube down. Team YouTube has, well it's not Team YouTube, it's Team Matty Ice from YouTube. Awesome subscriber, he's got three members left in here. Don't tell me Owen Hart is gonna be done, he got flipped over. Here comes Roman Reigns at 22. And Roman Reigns, he's gonna be working on his own. No teams, or no teammates left for the champ and he's sizing up with big ES and uh, wow I'm telling you the big man in black there he is pretty fresh at this point he's been in there for quite some time and he is very fresh but who's not fresh is Big Daddy Ice and Roman Reigns oh he's looking for his finisher what was he thinking here comes jo Joaquin Wild. Wow, nice job by Woods. Now is it Joaquin or Joaquin? Let me know in the comments, but let's see how Wild does here. Oh man, taking that knee, taking a, that was a pretty vicious knee. And now these teammates working against each other. The big boys, oh! That is gonna definitely stun you here. And now Big ES going after Roman Reigns. Here comes the British Bulldog, the final member of the Hart Foundation. 
Is he gonna save this team? Is he gonna save this team and get their ticket punch to the Champions Rumble? We shall soon see. We shall soon see. Let's see what happens, man. The Bulldog needs to use that strength. Oh, nice job with the counter elbow. Now the British Bulldog, I don't think he was very tall back in the day. I think he's like, what? Was he under six feet? Let me know in the comments. I'm not gonna check Google, but he's looking tiny right here. He's got the he's got the muscle mass, but he's not looking very tall. Part of me believes that he was like 5'10, 5'11, but I could be wrong. Don't tell me Kobe Kingston could be done. No, that's Xavier Woods. Let's see, is Woods gonna be done? He's done! What a creative way to get an elimination there by the snake. Holy smokes, and this team Matty Ice is just showing why they are top tier when it comes to these rumbles. It's not just top tier on the scales, brother. They are top tier when it comes to wrestling. And now, what a job there by the British Bulldog. Wow. Helping out, man. It's Kofi Kingston trying to stay in there, but there's just too much going on. There's too much going on. Nice job there by Wild. And now Roman Reigns. Is Roman Reigns going to do something here? Oh, look at this. Razor's Edge. Oh, seated power bob. And uh, Wild may be done here. Oh, brother. He is done. And I'm telling you, this, this team big man is just... Who's going to eliminate these guys? Who is going to eliminate these guys? Oh, clock from behind. That was a bad move by the British Bulldog. But he wanted to go after Roman Reigns. He's jealous. Here comes Matty Ice himself at 25. Matty Ice at 25. Don't tell me the Heart Foundation's going to be done. No, they're not. They're still in there, brother. They are still in there. And I got to say, man, Kofi Kingston, he's doing really well. Able to take on this challenge of what's in the ring right now and now I'm telling you the Matty Ice team they're fighting against each other they could easily just start taking out guys and working together but they're working against each other this late in the rumble I guess they feel that it's uh it's their time it's their time to shine as now there could be oh, here comes the rock Representing the uh, the team, I'm gonna butcher the name, the Anoa'i. Hopefully I said that right, but here comes The Rock coming in. And let me know, well, I guess you can't because you only do teams of five, if you could tie the Bloodlines and Anoa'i together, but you know they're all tied together through the Bloodlines, right? So shouldn't they be as one? Let me know, but here we go, are we gonna see Kofi Kingston out of there. He's getting flipped over. He is done. He is done. So now we got the snake that's still in there. He's going to go after his teammate. Oh, he is. He's going after his teammate. And he drops him right down. And now you got Matty Ice on the other side of things. Bulldog. He's trying. Oh, the Bulldog hesitated. The British Bulldog hesitated. Oh, nice job. Roman Reigns. Saving the British Bulldog. I guess he wants to get back at him for the British Bulldog going right at him earlier. But that could have eliminated the Bulldog, but he was saved. And now, how about this? You got The Rock going after oh, an extended family member in Roman Reigns. This is going to be... It's gonna be interesting right here just because I feel like the team Matty Ice with the size of these two big boys, it's gonna to be tough to eliminate them unless there's somebody else of size that is going to enter into this ring here. Here comes Santos Escobar. Oh, there goes The Rock. Oh my gosh, what was he thinking? Charging forward. Why were you charging forward, man? And now, you know, somebody with some size to counter these big boys is eliminated. So we'll see what happens here as we are nearing the end of this Rumble Episode 2, Season 6. As now, 
Oh, the big man dropping him down. Oh, nice job there by Snake hopping over. Going right after the British Bulldog. And oh, I can't believe Big Daddy Ice is still in this rumble. And now is Roman Reigns going to be done? Wow, this is like a new world order. Team Ice is taken over as the Bulldog is done. Oh no! The man with the most juice. Here comes Umaga at 28. The guy that had the most health, I believe, on Team Matty Ice is done. Oh, that could have been a mistake. And now Snake is stunned, but nobody sees him. Oh, Roman Reigns sees him and he eliminates him. Clutch work by Roman Reigns. And now, oh no, Umaga and Reigns fighting against each other. Santos Escobar. Imagine if Escobar could do it. Be the biggest upset on this channel. It'll be the biggest upset we've ever seen. So let's see what happens here now. Big kick. Oh, right to the head there by Matty Ice. Who is coming in now? Matty Ice with a big boot. Wow, that was vicious. That was vicious. Here comes Yokozuna at 29. Wow, Yokozuna coming in at 29. Representing the team. NOI. <laughs> NOI. <laughs> oh, man. But we got one more guy coming in. You got two members of Team Matty Ice. You got one member of the Bloodlines. One member of Legado del Fantasma. And then two members of NOI. Here we go. Andre the Giant representing the Heenan family at 30. And if there's somebody that's going to counter these big boys, it's going to be Andre himself. He tried to drop the leg like Hogan. What was Andre thinking right there? What was Andre thinking? And now Matty Ice looking for the elimination. He gets it. He gets it. Now we're down to two, four, six. Andre the Giant, Roman Reigns, Yokozuna, Big Daddy Ice, Matty Ice, Umaga. What's going to happen is now Yokozuna could be in some trouble here. Yokozuna has a lot of juice left. I'll be very surprised if he gets eliminated here. I'll be beyond surprised he doesn't get it. Now Roman Reigns with the counter elbow. And you got Team Matty Ice taking their time, trying to recover. As the big man, oh, oh, nice job by Yokozuna. And don't tell me Andre's gonna be done. Oh, no way, too early, brother. Wishful thinking, too early. And now Yokozuna and Roman Reigns fighting it out. Matty Ice trying to go after Andre, then he goes after Umaga. This guy, somebody test that guy. He is on something special. Now he's going after Andre. What agility by Andre. The ability to hop over like that and to still stay inside this ring was, uh, man, nothing short of amazing, really. But watch this. What's crazy, I got to say, is that you got Big Daddy Ice, who's been in there for an eternity, brother. He is taking his sweet time. He's not going in there looking to engage and how about that the size oh yeah the size really helped them there but now the teammates but see that the size right there for this big daddy ice helped them not go over those ropes oh what what's this what is this we didn't see that in WWE 2k22 to get tied up in the ropes like that that's very impressive and what's impressive is big daddy ice ability to just reverse Andre, and now he's going into side control, throwing some punches. What is gonna happen here? We're down to two, four, six. Oh, don't tell me the champ, Roman Reigns. Nice, oh, he needed that. He definitely needed that. Counter elbow, snap in the neck. But then, he's getting into just all that traffic is now he's unsure where to go. And at this point, it looks like it's every man to himself here. As Roman Reigns could be done. The big man, is he gonna throw him over? No look throw, and he's done. 
And now Yokozuna trying to go after. Oh, don't tell me Andre is. Oh, he's still in there. What a job by Umaga. Taking him out from behind there. Dropping his head right down to the canvas. Look at this tombstone. Oh, <laughs> tombstone action. And now the teammates, what are you doing? You're supposed to be working together as Matty Ice now. After all that, man, he kind of got caught up with his own teammate. He got put into a tough spot against Umaga. And now Umaga with an open hand strike. That was cool, an open hand uppercut. And Matty Ice doing the right thing. Sliding into the corner, trying to be as discreet as possible. As we've got the final five. And again, whoever wins this rumble, their team will go to the champion's rumble to go up against the other winners in this season. Right now we only have Team DX that are going to the champion's rumble. This is gonna be a quick season too. It, only, it will only feature seven episodes. So we'll see what happens, but I'm telling you, man. It's anybody's rumble. It's anybody's rumble we have, um, you know, Two of Matty Ice's team, we got the heels represented by only Andre and Team Anoa'i represented by Umaga and Yokozuna. But now Umaga, Umaga's feeling it. Is he gonna run? Oh, he's a sweet chin music. He doesn't eliminate him. Oh, that was clutch work by Matty Ice. I'm telling you, that was absolute clutch work. Matty Ice kind of looks like a cross between uh, Macho Man Randy Savage and, uh, oh, it's on tip of my tongue. Uh, Dr. Disrespect. <laughs> that is some funny stuff, but that was great work by Matty Ice. There was a lot of steam on that kick. That was a beautiful side kick. And he manages to stay in there. Could that be the story of this rumble right now? But these competitors here are just doing everything they can to stay inside this rumble. And oh, now and the teammates are fighting. Work together. There he goes, Yokozuna now. Coming to his senses. Helping out his teammate. And now is he going to help him out? Oh yeah, he went to go after him. Oh, but Andre is up from that mini break. And now Yokozuna. <laughs> Yokozuna is exhausted. Oh no. And if anybody can eliminate Matty Ice, you know it's Big Daddy Ice. Is he going to drop him out of there? Oh, man. And I want to tell you, too, I, I bumped up the loyalty to its highest. So, oh, and look at teammates fighting teammates. We're down to the final three. The Heenan family. Yokozuna's team. Oh, he's eliminated him. And now we're down to Big Daddy Ice and Yokozuna. Here we go. Yokozuna. Trying to dig down deep into the reserve. And Andre, look, he's, he's not accepting his defeat. And now are we going to see he's done? Oh, I'm telling you, Big Daddy Ice has been in there. I don't know when he came in, but he's been in there forever. This big man is showing his endurance. As I got somebody who's barking. My dog's barking. Is, is somebody at the door? Not quite yet, brother. It was the mailman. It was the mailman. But don't let me uh, get distracted, mailman. We're in the finals right here. As Yokozuna, is he going to do it? Don't charge forward, brother. Oh, clutch work by Big Daddy Ice. And he has gotten his team to the Champions Rumble. Wow, man. That is, look at these new replays. That is shocking. That is shocking. He had him. This man was running on fumes for the last 15 minutes. But this big man is going to the Champions Rumble. And I got to say, man, big shout out to Matty Ice, a very loyal subscriber of mine. He helps out behind the scenes on this channel. And his team made it, brother. Wow. That was highly entertaining. So he is going to now have his team in the Champions Rumble. And he'll, he'll be going up against Team DX for now. But we need... Four more teams and like I said if you want to feature your team in a future video just let me know email me and I'll do what I can no promises but I'll do what I can I would like to feature at least one team in uh, each video if possible but we'll see what happens anyways guys Ricky J had a great time man hope you enjoyed this one catch you next time peace